All right, so I don't want to set up my PC and whatnot and sit in front of it and just talk to you. So I'm going to come at y'all just like this. This is my Spider-Verse rant, right? So I seen, I seen Spider-Verse last night with my boy. And before I even got to see the movie, I was getting a lot of hype about it. I see Mark Phillips from Supreme Dreams, he posted, said this movie was gas and whatnot. Then I, the shorty hit me up, she told me this was the best Spider-Man movie ever. Best Spider movie ever. Animated, like everything combined. Then my brother told me this movie is super gas. He said nine and a half out of ten, I think. And mind you, the girl said 20 out of 10. I'm like, say less. So I mean my boy pulled up last night. We go watch it. W storytelling, the visuals was fire. I'm watching it. Dope characters. Miles Morales is the goat out of all the Spider-Mans. I'm watching like, wow, this is super tough. If it goes on, W pacing. Then we get to the, I broke. So just check this out. I had to pee so bad. And I know the movie was two hours and 40 minutes, but I was timing it in my head, but I'm watching parts. So we get to the end. Spoiler alert, we're gonna end. It's the part where um, Miles is trapped in the wrong universe and he sees his uncle. Then he sees the Prowler, and the Prowler is him in the Ultimate Universe. That part, I run to the back of my piss. I come back, and there's end credits. I'm sitting here like, wait, what? There's no way the movie ended like that. There's no way. I holler at my boy, I'm like, yo, what did I miss? And he's saying the same thing. He's like, no way the movie ended like that. Like, God, it's got to be a joke or something. No way it ended like that. He tells me how it ended. I'm like, so I basically missed nothing. I basically missed nothing. And then it's going to end up with the two be continued. Like, dog, no way. Once again, spoiler alert. If you've seen the movie, you know how it ends. Spa pulls up in Miles' universe. Gwen Stacy pulls up with a team of Spider-Man to save Miles Morales. Then it ends like that. Like, this is an animated film. This ain't Infinity War. Come on, you could have added an extra hour to finish that. Come on, man. And it's like, okay. So we got to wait nine months. Secondly, I'm going to say a year. We got to wait a year for part three. And it's like, how long is that going to be? Because, I mean, the way it was moving, you could have added an extra hour. We would have been straight. I'll say probably hour 30. I'm not going to lie, hour 30. But it's like, sheesh, how long is part three really going to be? We got to wait nine months for that? What? Man, they should have dropped that. They should have dropped that like the following week. Like that's crazy, bro. The cliff, like I, I, I like cliffhangers. Like I like keeping the fans hooked. Like that's what shows do. But a movie doing that is kind of tough. Like the, like, like cliffhangers are good, but like that type of cliffhanger, like, um, that's like that when the, that's when the movie was peaking. Like for example, Infinity War, the cliffhanger was. They almost got all the stones, snapped everybody, half the universe was gone, then he left. Cliffhanger is how the hero's gonna respond. W Cliffhanger. This, you can't cliffhanger at the peak, bro. Come on, like, y'all gotta get where I'm coming from. That cliffhanger is crazy, bruh. Oh my god, it's your boy Zeke Full Time, man. Like, share, subscribe. That's just my POV, man. Gone.